The capital of sunny Portugal, Lisbon, is situated at the point where the Tagus River estuary meets the Atlantic Ocean. As a travel destination, the riverfront city is as rich and varied as the country's long history. From the ruins of a Moorish castle perched atop one of the city's seven hills to a sidewalk cafe snuggled against an English Visigoth wall, remnants of Lisbon's colorful past are everywhere. While Western Europe's oldest city has taken steps to overhaul its transportation system, modernize its downtown area, and revamp its waterfront, it's the charm of Lisbon's oldest neighborhoods that most attract visitors. Da Gama Bridge Completed in 1998, the Vasco da Gama Bridge is a modern feat of engineering. Named after Portugal's most famous explorer, it was built to alleviate Lisbon's traffic congestion. Stretching for nearly 11 miles across the Tagus River, the Cable Stayed Bridge is so long that its builders had to take the Earth's curve into consideration when constructing it. But as an expense of $1.1 billion, the six-lane bridge is expected to stand for more than a century, ensuring that visitors can experience its breathtaking architecture for generations to come. Do Comercio One of the star attractions of Lisbon's downtown waterfront, the Praça do Comercio is an expansive plaza flanked by elegant 18th-century buildings. Portugal's Dom José I made his home here until the earthquake of 1755 reduced it to rubble. Locals still refer to the square as the Yard of the Royal Palace. A monument featuring the king on horseback dominates the center of the plaza. A large triumphal arch completed in 1873 anchors the northern side. Hotels, shops, and restaurants located nearby make this sunny square a popular destination for visitors exploring Lisbon's scenic waterfront. Square. There's no better place in Lisbon to soak up the local atmosphere than at Pedro IV Square, Lisbon's most famous plaza. Located in an elegant district in central Lisbon, the Rocio has been the city's main gathering place since the Middle Ages. During the Inquisition of the 16th century, the square served as a setting for public executions. Today, it's the place where friends meet up to enjoy a beverage at a cafe or bar before attending the National Theatre located on the north side of the square. Oceanarium One of the best modern tourist attractions in Lisbon, the Oceanarium was built as part of the improvements the city made when it hosted the 1998 World Exposition. Located in northeast Lisbon, the Oceanarium is the largest indoor aquarium in Europe. It's organized into four unique habitats, with each representing a different ocean. In addition to all manner of sea life ranging from sharks to penguins, flora from each ecosystem are represented as well.